So you might be confused for a minute as to what this is. So, Raymond Mini, as you probably heard in the first episode of Raymond Adventures, I said, is the game that I actually wanted to make a playthrough on. But of course, that just it just can't be that simple. Ubisoft made it a Apple Arcade exclusive thing, so you have to have an Apple phone. I don't have an Apple phone. I have a cheap garbage phone. So of course I don't have it, and it's I I I can't I can't play it. I'm sure there's some way I could pirate the game. I've actually pirated quite a few games from like on official websites app stores and stuff this I'm gonna be reacting to the final boss and the mister the mister dark update because as you probably know from my other video I love mister dark he is a really cool character and I've been dying to see something new from him since Rayman 1 there's been little references okay and of course Here's the video I'm reacting to. Here's the channel. Katak, and they are smaller channel than me, so I especially have to do that because that's kind of messed up. A bigger channel getting views off of a smaller channel. I just want to react to this and show you my reaction. I already know what the final boss is, but let's see what it looks like and what happens in it. If my phone will load, that is. Okay. So this is another. What the heck was that? This is another Raymond Run game. This is a boss. So I've seen the other bosses. I'm glad that this game has bosses, but they're kind of mediocre bosses. They're not really bosses. You don't fight them much. You just run from them. And he, this is actually the first boss of the game. It just in my family. He missed the drug shroom. I don't know what the point of the drug. Mushroom is, but yeah. I guess I could pretend that I'm playing it. Uh, 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 no, that's stupid. Strangely enough, I don't think this game has the same features that Raymond Adventures has. You'd think it'd be bigger and better, but uh, it's still got the same loading screen. Wait, what was that? Cata Heller? Cata. Cata Hell Art. What? Yes. Kind of name. I also don't see how this is much of a boss fight. This is just writing it. Every time I try to record a video, my freaking alarm goes off. I should really plan these things. Uh, a lot of people give a lot of flack to this game, but I don't, because it's got a lot of new stuff compared to Raymond, uh, Jungle and Fiesta Run, which are just Raymond Origins on the phone, certain worlds from it, and Adventures is just Raymond Legends on the phone. This game is its own thing, more like it. Okay, here we go. Bo final boss, which is kind of stupid. First the character. Ooh. Here we go. It's cool music already. So the final boss. The game's story is so weird. The flaming teensy who was a hero in the other games turns Raymond small. I thought, but he is the villain. I thought that maybe oh. It just happened that way. Maybe you did it for fun or something. I don't know. Maybe it's just helpful? No, he is the villain of this game, as you can probably see. So that's weird. I do kind of like that, actually, though. I like having characters that are more... What the heck? Villainous. Not just, like, playable characters. Like, you can play as Ramius and Glomberox, and they're villains. So... But nothing ever said Flaming Teensy was evil. They definitely get, he's definitely weird. 
He's not known as the most heroic person. The weirdo who spends way too long. Oh, he has magic. This is cool because we don't really see much of Teensy's powers other than that one. And who are the magical Teensy twins? Does anyone know? I know one of them is the magical Teensy, the wizard one. Is this the other one? Wait, that's the whole. That's it? That's the boss? You don't even fight him. That was it. This game is kind of underwhelming. That was... That was kind of underwhelming. Hmm. Well... Is that it? Yeah, let's go at it. Okay. But that's not all. We, um, that was cool and all, but obviously the one that we're really looking for is the Mr. Dark one. This is the cool one. Okay, let's do it. Here we go. I've seen a few seconds of this, but I haven't watched the levels. Mm, here we go. Oh, my freaking phone sucks. For the faint-hearted, the higher your awesomeness is, the harder the challenge, and the bigger the reward. He's like Snatcher from, uh, from Hat in Time. He's evil, but he's also working with you, and he's doing contracts. So that's cool. Okay, this isn't, uh, this is cool related to Mr. Dark, but I'm not seeing any Mr. Dark action. So... Also, this is the first time teams have even appeared in this game. Okay. Creepy voice. It's the same thing. Bone, stop sucking. Okay. But I know for a fact there is a Mr. Dark boss battle. I heard about it, saw it, talked about. I just hope that it's gonna be good. I love his new design. He looks tattered and beat up from like when he was defeated in his last game. Here we go. The garden. What the heck is that? The garden. Don't tell me they bring the freaking Incrediballs into this. Bruh. You already had the Incrediballs in the last game. Okay, let's see it. Cool. Eek, wow. So great. Okay. Is there no boss yet? Doesn't. Nope, that's it for now. Okay, next. Okay. Looks awesome. This is hand there behind that contract. Ooh, what's this? Come on.
Oh, it's just a new level. Is this where the fight comes in? I'll be disappointed if it's not me. Please just show me the boss. If there is one, if people talked about it, there better be. I better not have been lied to. Is this it? Can this be it now? Oh, come on. That's cute. Wait, where? Is it? I was lied to. Brick. <laughs> 